Hey, Don here. Okay, well, I, I wanted to do a quick video um, about my internet connection. Now, I can't even do a speed test right now. It's so bad. And the reason is that I'm uploading a YouTube video. This happens every time. Sometimes not quite so bad. Sometimes it's just slow, you know, really slow. Uh, but it's very, it's, uh, here lately, last couple, of, I've had to upload a couple of few videos in the last, well, well just to say the last month. It does this. And it started it years ago. And I don't upload videos very often, you know, like just straight to YouTube from my drive very often. Uh, I, I, I like to only just do live videos uh, and then they're uploaded as a go. Now, that's not a problem. But for some reason, it just, uh, you know, brings everything to a screeching halt. Uh, I noticed that it's first off, I was trying to send, e checking my emails, they wasn't coming in. Like, here's one I sent to myself. Well, that came in just fine. Uh, any with some stuff in them, you know. Uh, let's try that one. That one would have a lot of stuff in it. And that's working. Okay, well, it just goes back and forth. Well, there you go. That should have already came in. And that will take a while to load. Um, and that's just, you know, that should have came in at the most within 10 seconds. So, uh, I'll just leave it alone. Uh, guess I can get off of it. I'll get off of it so I won't keep on. Well, I guess it's still going to try to load it either way. But uh, let me try reloading the test page <coughs> you see I still have I'm at 94% it's almost done so I'm trying to hurry <coughs> oh crap I forgot to switch the camera to desktop mode okay here we go uh, I'm at 95% on the upload there's the error so it's still there it went away because I had already hit reload on the page but that was the error uh, that you get and I had already hit reload a while ago before I realized I was on the wrong page but uh now this page, this is still not, I guess it was on its way. I guess it did quit loading. So, I mean, when emails don't even load, uh, that's pretty bad. And uh, what I'm saying, I can't do a speed test right now. See, the site won't even reload. That's how bad it is. I can't even get the speed test site to work. Uh, it's just ridiculous. And I haven't called them in... I haven't called them in a couple of years, but most of the time I don't have to deal with this because, like I said, I, I do live streaming. But I had one that got failed last night and broke, lost the connection during during the middle of my stream, so I'm uploading the backup video. That's why I always make backup videos. But, uh, you know, I don't think it's, uh, I don't know what the, ba you know, what kind of bandwidth is, you know, has been trying to take the upload. I would guess that the upload bandwidth must all of my upload bandwidths must be used being used up, but uh, well, I, I don't think it's that it's using so much. You know, like I have five. I tested it just earlier today. There's my test right before I started this upload. Uh, sixty. See, I got sixty sixty six point seventy one megabits down, five point sixty three up. Now, I, as long as it takes to upload this video. They were saying when I started about an hour. Uh, let's see, now the page don't even work. I would try another one, but I can't. Well, none of them are really any faster at loading. Close that tab and see. See if that page will even come in. See, it's almost there. As soon as that finishes, it's not going anywhere now. I'm going to hit my home page and see so it's uh, I am still uploading and it's almost done but it's like it's it's killed my internet connection no download I can't download anything and I think that's because the upload pipe is closed but it's not all being used up I mean there's just no way I don't it's nothing you don't see these kind of well I haven't been searching lately but like I talked to my um, I used, my next door neighbor he moved away but he's still on charter or spectrum he uh, still email with him, and we'll we'll email each other when you know is yours having trouble, you know stuff like that. And he's never had that kind of trouble. 
course, he doesn't up. He is not really into YouTube, so he hasn't doesn't do that. But even when he lived here, uh, he's been moved away a year or two now. But still, like I said, okay. So that finally came in. Let's try. I think it's almost done now. Now it's back to ninety five percent. I wonder why it did that. Maybe it's because it really was jacking up, you know. Easily, I yeah, I can't even go anywhere. And I don't want to have to call them because everything's fine other than this, and I don't like calling them and arguing with them. you you got to go around and around with them to convince them that your problem's real. And all it does is make me really angry for a couple of days. I've tried to get them to get get through to you know try to get through to somebody's head to get them to try to fix it and somebody can you know before that you know finally they'll send somebody out when it gets to the point. One time I I, I was on the phone with him and I said okay I started an upload and I said he said did a speed test from his remote location you know the tech support for charter and he uh, I'll close the page now and we'll just watch the upload and. Uh, <coughs> It may have stopped. Maybe it completely, uh, a week or so ago when I was uploading videos, one time it completely killed the connection during the upload, and I had to <laughs> reboot my modem. Usually I don't have... <coughs> Usually I don't have to reboot my modem. Um, very often, I go months, maybe six months, but this last month or so, over a month, uh, I'm having... I'd start, it, would, I, it would do like this, and I would just flat lose my connection while I was trying to upload the videos. And I'll try it one more time before I go reboot the modem. Okay, now it came in. Look at that. And that came in like it should. Now let's see if I can do a speed test. Looks like it's going to make do a speed test. Okay, now it's look, looking like normal. Uh, and it's just so erratic. So it's not that YouTube is hogging all the bandwidth. Well, actually, they, well, I mean, I guess they, there's no way that I can, you know, in the YouTube app that, or the website that we can set our upload speed. They do that. But, uh, you know, just like when you're watching videos, it automatically, it tries to send you the uh, quality on the download to watch the video that your, your connection can fit. I always leave it on automatic, can use. Now, it's back to normal. So, uh, do a screenshot of that too. I've been doing screenshots. I always do that when I want to be able to know something later. But uh, let's see. No, it's not done yet. Okay, it's almost done. Now you're seeing the preview. So I, I was. I'm glad I didn't reboot my modem or anything because I would have lost my. Uh, I'm just gonna wait. You know, that's the one thing. Used to, I swear on YouTube. Used to, it would say, uh, okay, this upload will be finished, um, you know, in the background, and you can just go off and do whatever you want. But now it says stay on this page, which is a pain because if you forget, you're messing around and going to other, you know, sites, and you forget and close that page, you're going to break your upload. I've done it. It does happen. It's saying you can go there to see the video. Okay. So I guess it's 95% done because I haven't clicked publish, so I'll do that. Let's just click on this and see if it see if it plays something. It's not ready yet. I figured that. Oh, that's after you hit publish. Let's hit publish. Okay, now you oh there's that link. I was gonna say you lose the link, but this oh yeah, I'm gonna send that I always email this to myself, so I'm gonna leave it open. But um Okay, it looks like it's going to work. Usually when you get through the live stream, it's kind of still working on their servers. Like, I don't know, maybe it has to <clears throat> convert it from FLV to the format they use. Uh, but it won't all uh, play in for 30 minutes to an hour. Well, let's see if I can flip through it. <laughs> I'm just not talking right there. I don't think I can go to the router because I'm in different amounts of voltages. Oh, I guess you'd have to be a true elect 
on different schedules. Okay, so yeah, it's all there and playable. I guess when you upload them, it's it's there. But uh, I guess I should have left that. It's the only page I probably really wanted open. Uh, so I've already published, so let me just paste that. Uh, I might want to, uh, you know, edit the uh, comments and all that junk, uh, description, and the title too. Here, I left, I left the, I, I made the file name itself something that would make me be able to tell what video it's replacing, uh, so I can organize it. But I'm going to change it to a descriptive title, you know. All right, so this. And share that with myself. I hope my audio is good and everything because I didn't do any sound tests or anything before I started. And I actually did do a couple of changes because I remembered. Uh, I backed off on my gain a little bit and raised. Well, actually, what had happened, it looked like I had bumped my knobs on my mixer. And I noticed when I got close to the mic last night, uh, I was kind of skipping through the video that it was distorting a little bit. And I usually don't have that problem. Uh, because I have a compressor no, on there on my I'm running it out of the mixer and then into a compressor But if it's distorted if it's too much gain in the mixer It's going to distort before it gets to the, the compressor and it's not going to be able to fix that Let's see if my email Note to self, as soon as I get done here, go get you a cold pill. I'm going to be doing this all day if I don't. I'm starting to really drain too much. I guess one thing, I don't, well, you know what? I, can't, oh, I never can decide but which is better, the windows open or closed. <clears throat> but I do have the, I did just, I have the window open. So it could be something in the air getting to me. <clears throat> but I'm draining like crazy, so that's really what it is. Well, why am I draining like crazy? Maybe there's something I'm in the air that I'm allergic to. I do it every day anyway. The windows open or closed. If I leave them closed, even when it's you know when it's cold weather and you leave them closed for several days, it gets this. I can't breathe. This all the oxygen is gone out of this room. And really and truly, that is what happens. Uh, you got three people in a 1,200 square foot house, and if the wind and whole thing's closed up for a week or so, or three days to a week, you're you're just breathing in the oxygen and out car, uh, carbon dioxide yeah and you know you really can just there's not much to, this house is kind of tight so there's not much well, it's not real tight but a couple of the doors but not enough air though not enough circulation so uh, anyway I have not been awake that long so I'm not with it <clears throat> what am I going to do okay I'm going to put all that in my title so I'll know what the heck it is. Okay, now, I'm going to uh, I'm going to get all my uh, Trying to figure out my top. I'm going to go rename these. Uh, I'm just going to stay on the video till I'm done with what I'm doing. Uh, I'll first. For one thing, 
I want to get all these. Uh, these are not just thumbnails. These are the full size screenshots and they will use up your memory when you get about 10 or 15 of them it'll actually slow your machine down so but that's oh <clears throat> it's my favorite screenshot app it's for its functionality so and i'm going to this too or wait too, too many too often but the other one actually does worse so uh, for using that you can't take you can't do that and get it to quit using up memory the other one will just hang keep that screenshot in your memory and your RAM, I mean, your RAM memory, and uh, you can't get it out of there. You can't kill it. That it, the process the, still showing in the process viewer over here in your processes. It'll show. They'll all show in here. And I want. I've done it like 10, 15, 10, 15, 20 of them, and the machine will just get slower and slower and slower. And you can't even as a root, you can't kill them. Uh, and all Fedora distros, every since at least like 19. I think it, I know start to notice it in Fedora 19. It's crazy they never fixed it. That's the green genome screenshot tool that does that. This is uh, some of an S. Oh, uh, Shutter. I don't have it written on here. I used to call it Shutter, Shutter screenshots, but I I put screenshots from all different apps in here, so I decided to quit doing that. <coughs> so anyway, it's got a, but it's been like that forever. Shutter, uh, so it's got a bug in it too. All right, so I'm going to. Look through and see which ones I want to want to rename. That one. Oh, that one. Yeah. That's the good one. See, there's the one I couldn't even run a screen screen. Uh, couldn't even do it. And that's last night when I was having lost my connection to my router. Okay, <clears throat> which was because of the Ash Rock crash, and that's a whole different thing. Um. Okay, so we want 1086, 87, 88, 88, 86, 87, 88. There, I want to rename those. You know what? I better rename them one at a time because, yeah, this one is. Okay, we'll go. Oh, wait, that's not going to work good. I know what's going to happen. I'm gonna rename them all, and then, and then uh, with the app, and then manually. <laughs> I don't know what the heck I'm doing. I'm gonna copy that whole sentence and just kind of put it, put it in there, and then figure out what to take out. Okay. When you have a bunch of files, it's definitely worth it. Right now, I don't have that many, but. Now, but see, here's what I, the good thing about this is uh, I can take out all my spaces. This is a uh, K rename. I can take out my commas, and I just always replace them. I, with images and stuff that you might upload to a server somewhere, it, they usually uh, work better. Some servers don't like spaces. It won't work right. So I think I'll go through and re-edit that a little bit. But now the basics of it's good. And I'm going to get rid of some, some yeah, a lot of, some older. I don't know. It's not necessarily that they're older. It just depends on what brand of server. <clears throat> like a straight Unix server. That's before I ever discovered Linux when I learned this. Which Linux is, is a built, basically, like Linux, Unix. It's a Unix compatible. Uh, I don't think it was necessarily built on the Unix code. I think it was a complete rewrite, if I remember right. But, uh, okay, what did I do there? My thing didn't work right. <clears throat> I don't know what I did. Oh, it didn't happen because I didn't set, hit OK. There we go. Whoops. Oh, I got... Got that one wrong. Should be a left bracket. Okay, now let's make a name that's not quite as long. 
Oh, speed test was finally good. Yeah, I'll leave it like that, and then I'll just take out what I don't want. Okay, that's actually exactly the name I want. Okay. We do have some extra, so just get three dashes, two dashes. That should make it all, make them all one dash. And the date, well, the date's not on there, is it? Oh, three, oh, eight, eighteen. Some of the screenshot apps put the date in there and some of them don't. Yeah. Okay. Okay. Now, that should be good and that is not anything to do with that. You know what? I'm going to leave it like that. that. I'll know what's going on here. And that'll keep them in a little group together. You know, these screenshots, they're not real big, but they make a difference when you do a lot of them on, on filling up your drive. I think there's some, yeah, they're not very big. These are not the big ones. Like this, this app, some of them will make screenshots that are, well, see, now those are 1.2 megabytes. I guess it, well, it depends on if you're doing web pages and you do the whole thing, <clears throat> they can get larger. So that's what makes them add up. But uh, I watch, I've watched my space shrink from about 18 gigabytes. Right now it's lower because I'm making a video. <clears throat> I have two videos on here. But uh, I watched it in the last month, two, two months, shrink from about 18 gigabytes to about 16-something. And I really can't find what it is because I tried to delete everything along the way. and get it after it's backed up on my backup drive. I tried to delete everything so that <clears throat> for long the life of this system for me until I can <clears throat> get done with my mom's. and uh, re upgrade mine we get rid of the XP part uh, Windows 7 oh you can't do but one at a time <clears throat> so I'll do them like that let's make this big enough to see it well, if you don't know how to do all these things I'm doing right now, then maybe this is helpful. Yeah. I'll have to upload this one if I want to put it up. I'll look at it and see if I want to do that. I think I will. That means another pain in the butt, so I won't do it today. <coughs> I'll have to, because what I'm going to do is I'm going to reboot my r modem and my router make sure everything's working good before I start my get to work back work on the machines and do my next stream <clears throat> I think when I'm sending this to myself I'll send it to my old, old neighbor too uh oh that that is not I messed up that when I was I'd always do it like <clears throat> select it with my keyboard but I didn't get it all let's see if I can Well, I'll, I'll just, uh, what the heck did I just do? I don't know. I clicked on something by accident, and it opened it up in Firefox. So, I can't find my cursor there. I think that'll fix that link, uh, hopefully. Format. I always do it with a keyboard so I don't pay attention to that. Okay, yeah, I think it's good. Looks good. No, it's not good. It has the three and not the four. We'll just type a four. No, I'm going to copy and paste that whole thing. Make sure it's right. Yeah, so if you ever do that, you're going to have to go make sure your links... Uh, it's not going to fix it by just doing it again with the keyboard. Now let's look at link properties. Format link properties. Yeah, now it has the four. Okay. Um, there we go.
de... I might want to add that to this sentence down here. <coughs> oh, there it is. While video was uploading. Okay, see screenshots. All right. Now, I'll send that in a minute. Uh, I won't put my old neighbor's email address in here. Okay. Uh, oh. Where is it? I am confused. I can't find my spot now. Man. Okay, this is not the video. This is the one I just uploaded. Okay, all right. I knew that. Okay, once I finish this video, then I could rename. I will do that. I'll rename it in a way so that I know what it is. I might use those uh, screenshot names, actually. Can't rename it while it's recording, though. Yeah, that would be easier to do that than copying it from the email body. Okay. Uh, <coughs> okay, that's oh, good enough. I uh, finally got that. I finally, I never, I've, I've thought, probably thought about it before over the last few years, but I just thought, heck, I'm already almost ready to make videos, so let me just catch this while it's uploading and show what it's doing. <coughs> All right. Maybe if I upload it, uh, more people will have say, "Hey, I'm having the same problem." You know, maybe I could always wish that that would get somebody to do something to fix it. Whoever's, I think I'm sure it's with a Charter Spectrum. It was over. You know, they just changed the name to Spectrum uh, ISP. I'm sure it's something in the hardware out here in the wiring in the you know the junction boxes on the corner. That there's one down on the corner down the way that. Usually gives trouble when when everybody starts losing, having trouble with their connection. They go down there and fix something. So, <clears throat> all right, um, that's it. Well, I, I meant to switch to my camera. Okay, bye. -bye.